The gist of what we're saying, that uh, there is a correlation between people who watch the money and then watch their you-know-what when it looks like it's in, in danger. Craig Smith knows that uh, fear and greed motivates the street, and uh, there was some fear for a while today. What do you make of all this, Craig? Yeah, it's, it's amazing. Of course, if you watch Fox Business, and if you don't get it, Neil, I suggest that you have demanded immediately, because they're demanding the things all over the world told me that, but that's good for you, but go ahead. Hey, you know, they're demanding things all over the world right now, but yeah, the, the market's been up and down, as we know, and, and it's very sensitive right now, and I think you're right. I don't think it has to do strictly with this bombing issue. I think that there are other issues on the street as it relates to softness in the economy, but I find it very interesting on May Day, Neil. All these, these people out there screaming, we want more government, we want them to help us out. What you're seeing, Neil, is a great withdrawal. Matter of fact, that's the name of my new book that will be out in early summer. It's called The Great Withdrawal. When Too the government to you have for to that very well-timed plug. But, but well, as we're showing, Craig, on these, some of these protests around the world today, uh, it all, it's, this is sort of like their labor revolt day. And they're revolted at governments that are not doing as much for them as they, they've gotten used to. These cradle-to-grade protections are going away because governments can't afford them. And they're not taking it lightly, are they? No, and, and look, it's just like your drug dealer saying, hey, there's not going to be any more drugs, so you've got to go through withdrawal. And let's face facts, Neil, we have given drugs all over this world. Look at the bailouts in Cyprus, Portugal, Greece. Has anything changed economically? No. Look at the bailouts in 2008. We still have no low, low uh, growth. We have still high unemployment. These people have to realize that the government is not the answer to the problem. Neil, the government is the problem. They right. try to manage economies, and that's not what a government is supposed to do. And when the tough medicine comes out, they don't like it. Craig, thank you for your patience yeah. and all the breaking news. Craig Smith, we're going to explore this in a lot more detail on the African.